in this video we are going to discuss about finite automata with output the best examples for finite automata with output are more mission mille mission whereas dfa and nfa are the examples for finite automata without output why because dfa or nfa doesn't produces any output after reading the input string uh, if we get the final state then the string is said to be accepted after reading the input string if we don't get final state then we can say that the string is not accepted the string is rejected so that's why dfa and nfa are the examples for finite automata without output whereas according to the input if we want to produce some output then we have to use finite automata with output so the best examples are more mission mille mission so first let us see about more mission and after that we will discuss about uh, mille mission so first let's see about more mission more mission is represented by six tuple q comma sigma comma so this is also called as delta let it be big delta so big delta comma delta comma lambda comma q not so in order to show some difference between these two let us assume that this is big delta or we can pronounce both these as delta also there is no problem so here q means q is similar to finite automata only q represents a finite set of states if we observe this uh, uh, more mission so the uh, here q means set of states so what are the states here q not q1 q2 so those three are the states here so q means q1 q not q1 q2 so q is nothing but q not q1 and q2 now let us see the next one next tuple sigma just like uh, dfa nfa here sigma represents input alphabet input alphabet so here the input alphabet symbols are 0 and 1 0 and 1 we can apply 0 on the state or we can apply 1 on the state next one is big delta delta so delta is called as output alphabet output alphabet here within the circle in more mission within the circle uh, we specify the output here the output of q0 is 1 output of q1 is 1 output of q2 is 0 so in more mission where the output is specified within the state only within the state only next one is delta it is also similar to dfa and nfa delta is a transition function which maps from q cross sigma to q it is similar to dfa it is similar to dfa whereas in nfa delta means q cross sigma to 2 power q okay so here the delta means dfa delta so q cross sigma to q so this q means current state so sigma means input alphabet so input alphabet mainly contains two symbols whereas this q means output that is next state here this q means the next state so current state means q whereas sigma means 0 1 this q means next state next state next state so if we apply an input symbol on the current state then a new state will be generated so this is the corresponding new state and the last one is uh, lambda Uh, uh, fifth one one two three four five so lambda means output function output function in more mission the output always depends upon the present state the output always depends upon the present state that, that you will get the clarity while uh, uh, drawing the transition table and the last one is q not q not means initial state q not means initial state okay so what is this lambda lambda means output function here this output output always depends upon the 
current state only output always depends upon the present state only it doesn't depends upon the present input here one more important point is more mission or melee mission doesn't contain any final state why because here what is our target our target is to produce an output according to the string according to the input string so that's why more mission and melee mission doesn't have any final state here q not uh, let us uh, so this is about uh, more mission explanation now let us see this diagram so this is more mission uh, uh, diagram uh, if we observe this diagram here q not is the initial state we don't have any final states here we don't have any final states here so q not is initial state so q1 and q2 are the next two states these uh, there is no final state in this diagram let us observe about this diagram here the output of q0 is 1 output of q1 is 1 output of q2 is 0 so if you write here let the first state is q0 second state is q1 next state is q2 what is the output of q0 1 what is the output of q1 1 what is the output of q2 0 so here the output depends only on the current state it doesn't depends upon the next it doesn't depends upon the input symbol if it is 0 or if it is 1 then there is no change in the output so that's why here we have written this point lambda means an output function here the output depends here the output depends only on the current state present state this is the output lambda here the output depends only on the current state so output depends only on the current state it doesn't depends upon the any input symbol okay here if we apply 0 on q0 it moves to the q1 state next to q0 on 1 means q0 on 1 goes to the q2 q1 on 0 goes to q2 q1 on 1 goes to q1 only next q2 on 0 goes to q2 only q2 on 1 goes to q0 so this is the more mission diagram now let us see the transition table transition table so here we have three columns current state so q0 current state may be either q0 or q1 or q2 next we have to apply 0 and 1 input symbols we have to apply 0 on 1 input symbol then we will get some next state and the third column represents output next let us let us draw this table q0 on 0 q0 on 0 goes to q1 next q0 on 1 goes to q2 next q1 on 0 goes to q2 so this is that uh, input symbol q1 on 1 i'm sorry q1 on 1 q1 on 1 goes to q1 only next q2 on 0 means self loop q2 only next q2 on 1 means it will goes to q0 so here 1 is nothing but output of the q0 this one is output of q1 this 0 is output of q2 in more mission output is always specified within the circle uh, now let's say, now let us see the input string let we have an input string called uh, 0 double one zero now we have to generate the corresponding output string here in more mission if the size of the input string is n then output string produces n plus one if the size of the input string is n then the size of the output string will become n plus one so what is the input string here zero double one zero is the input string so delta of starting state is q0 comma 0 comma double one zero q0 comma 0 double one zero here this is what more mission in more mission what will happen the output depends only on the current state output doesn't depends upon any input symbol output doesn't depends upon 0 or 1 so that's why initially epsilon epsilon will be applied on the q0 
initially epsilon we know about epsilon so epsilon means without applying any input uh, we will get the output okay so here initially we are at q naught state uh, initially let us assume that epsilon is applied so delta of here uh, no input symbol is applied here so what is the output of q naught output of q naught is 1 so we will get 1 as the output next delta of q naught comma here no input is applied so 0 double one zero. now apply 0 now apply 0 what is the output of q naught output of q naught is 1 next q naught on 0 it will goes to q1 q1 comma 0 input is applied so what is the remaining string 110 110 here we have q1 what is the output of q1 1 next we need to apply 1 q1 on 1 means q1 on 1 means it will goes to q1 on 1 means it will goes to q1 so q1 comma so 1 is applied so what is the remaining string 1 comma 0 1 comma 0 next here we have q1 what is the output of q1 1 next q1 on 1 means q1 on 1 means it will stay at q1 only so q1 comma this one is applied now next the remaining string is 0 q1 what is q1 output 1 is the q1 output so 1 is uh, q1 on 1 means uh, q1 on 1 means uh, 1 is the output next q1 on 0 means q1 on 0 means what is the state q1 on 0 means q2 is the state but the entire input string is processed so what is the output here 3 bull 1 double 1 so here the output string is 5 ones so 1 2 3 4 5 so 5 ones this is the output output string contains how many what is the size of the output string the size of the output string is 5 so this is about more mission now let us see the second one that is melee mission melee mission is a, is also represented by using six tuple q comma sigma comma big delta comma uh, delta comma lambda comma q naught here except lambda remaining tuples are similar to more mission only so q means a finite set of states sigma means input alphabet uh, this big delta means uh, uh, it is it uh, big delta means it is output alphabet here output the means uh, this left hand side is nothing but input right hand side means output so one is input zero means output if you consider this one this left hand side is input right hand side is output so delta means this big delta means uh, it is output symbol so output symbol output alphabet Output alphabet also contains 0 and 1. Uh, instead of 0, 1, we may have either A, B or X, Y or C, D, any, any inputs. There is no problem. Next one is delta. It is a transition function which maps from Q cross sigma to Q only. It is also similar to DFA. Uh, next one is lambda. So, lambda means output function. But here the output depends on the present state as well as present input. This is the major difference between more mission and melee mission. In more mission, the output, the output depends only on the present state. Here, this output is depends only on the present state. Whereas in melee mission, in melee mission, the output depends on the present state as well as present uh, uh, input, present state and input. So here the mapping is. Lambda is the output function which maps from Q cross sigma to delta. Next Q naught is the initial state. So we know that uh, uh, more mission, mille mission doesn't have any final states. Uh, next, uh, let us see the mille mission diagram. Let us consider this diagram. Uh, here we have three states, Q naught, Q1, Q2, where Q naught is the initial state. So Q naught on 0, it goes to Q2, output is 1. So here 0 is the input left hand side is input right hand side is output so 0 is in input out, 1 is output so q naught on 0 goes to q2 uh, output is 1 
next q0 on 1 goes to q1 output is 0 likewise q1 on 0 goes to q1 output is 0 q1 on 1 goes to q2 output is 1 q2 on 0 goes to q2 output is 0 q2 on 1 goes to q0 output is 0 now let us draw the uh, transition table let us construct the transition table here the states are q0 q1 q2 so q0 on 0 goes to q2 so this is current state next state output and uh, input symbol so if we apply this is 0 this is 1 so q0 on 0 next to q0 on 1 what is the next state and what is the output so q0 on 0 goes to q2 state next state output is 1 next q0 on 1 q0 on 1 goes to q1 output is 0 next q1 on 0 goes to q1 output is q1 on 0 output is 0 only next q1 on 1 goes to q2 output is 1 next q2 on 0 goes to q2 output is 0 next q2 on 1 goes to q0 output is 0 now let us uh, uh, take some input string let the input string is 1001 uh, in melee mission if the input string contains if the size of the input string is n then output string size is also n okay here the input string size is 4 so the output string uh, size will also become 4 whereas in more mission if the size of the input string is n then the output string produces n plus 1 size of the output string will become n plus 1 okay so now let us uh, 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 here what is the initial state q0 is the initial state and what is the string 1001 so q0 on 1 q0 on 1 previously in more mission we have applied a epsilon transition why because their uh, output depends only on the current state so current state uh, uh, by applying uh, uh, epsilon it, it generated uh, that output q0 output whereas here the output depends on the current state as well as input so here we must apply an input symbol in order to produce the output there in more mission without applying input also uh, we got the output at the first step q0 on 1 means q0 on 1 q0 on 1 means q1 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 and what is the output 0 so q1 comma 1 is over so remaining string is uh, double zero one. Next Q1 on zero. Q1 on zero goes to Q1. Q1. What is the output? Zero is the output. Zero is over. So the remaining string is zero one. Next uh, Q1 on zero goes to Q1 on zero goes to Q1 output is zero. So output is zero. And uh, what is the state? Q1 is the state. This zero is over. So the last input symbol is one. So Q1 on 1, Q1 on 1, Q1 on 1 goes to uh, goes to Q2, but output is 1. Okay. The, so here uh, it ends at Q2 state. Here what is the output? 3001. 3001. This is the output. So input string contains 4, input string length is 4, output string length is also 4. So this is about finite automata with output. So that is more mission and uh, melee mission.